Good morning. I'm Lori Grood, and I am delighted to take this opportunity to say hello to you as the fifth head of the Gateway School. I will tell you, however, that of all the ways I imagined starting my first year at Gateway, this was not one of them. More than anything, I was looking forward to starting our journey together and beginning to build important relationships with colleagues and families. I had a clear picture in my mind about walking through these new lobby doors on July 1st, as excited as, and as nervous as a child on her first day of school. And about three months ago, it started to dawn on me that this may go a little differently than this planned. So let's start with a basic unequivocal fact. This pandemic happened. It is still happening. And in so many ways, it's turned our lives upside down and has forced us to look at, look at life in ways we never once imagined. To borrow from our mission, we are all learning differently now. Through the entire search process, I spoke about one thing, relationships. I have come to recognize that one of the most critical factors in helping a young person to thrive during both routine and uncertain times is the power of a meaningful relationship between teacher and students. Without strong relationships, there is no teaching, there is no leadership, and there is no school. School, as we have all seen so poignantly this spring, is a lot more than just a building. Teachers teach children long before they teach their subject matter. There is a profound relationship between home and school. A family chooses to place their trust in the school and the school earns that trust daily to connect a family's understanding of their child with a teacher's knowledge and compassion of what that child needs to thrive is a privilege. Further, the relationship between teacher and student is one which can transform lives for the better. It is a relationship which must be honored and cherished. We are a community that knows what it means to face challenges. And because of this, we have a resilience that is unique to our population. I believe that every child, every teacher, and every parent has a story to tell. At Gateway, there is time to honor and share those stories. Every family who has crossed the threshold on West 61st Street, or who will cross that threshold, starts with a shared map. The anxiety of that parent conference, the unwelcome emails and phone calls, the held breaths during birthday parties, the fear that something wasn't quite right. Then the school applications that asked you more to, uh, that asked you more than you were ever willing to ask yourself. The tour that suddenly allowed you to breathe, and then the discovery that you have found a gateway, a new beginning. And I want you to know something. We will teach your children, but there is more to it than that. At Gateway, I promise you, we will love your children. We will love them for exactly who they are while helping them to be the best they can be. Now, along those lines, I want to single out a single group of people, the Gateway faculty. A school's heart and soul is its teachers, and the Gateway faculty is a shining example of heart and soul. When our world shifted, we found our heroes. In this case, it was the faculty. This faculty has worked so hard they basically redesigned their own world in a week. And look what they did in the last 10 weeks of school. When school was the closest thing to what most of our children had to normal, this group of educators took their experience, their training, and their commitment to children and kept the program going. Now, to be clear, this did not happen in a vacuum. Led by an exceptional program team and senior administrators and under the clear-eyed guidance of the inimitable Carolyn Salzman. The Gateway faculty and staff did what needed to be done, and the, fa and the faculty made the magic happen. Despite challenges and disruptions to their own lives, despite the recognition that their work would be under unusual and constant scrutiny, they were there every morning, every afternoon, accepting no less than the standards they have settled for throughout the year. And through it all, they delivered meaningful and needed content and kept relationships strong. Gateway is a school 
for children who live and struggle with language-based learning disabilities. Our mission has meaning. We say outright that at Gateway, our students become skilled strategic learners and confident self-advocates. We acknowledge that language-based literacy and thinking skills are the foundations of success. We believe in a close relationship between school and home. These are our tenets. They matter now more than ever. So what next? My plan and hope was to invite you in this summer. There would be time to talk, there would be time to listen. What I envisioned cannot happen, but that does not mean that an invitation to talk can't happen. It certainly can. Whether it is online or in person, we will create opportunities for families to come together and share their greatest hopes. This holds true for faculty as well. Coffee with the Head may take place through Zoom, but it's going to happen. I will be here and I will be available. You will hear from me regularly. Stay tuned for bi-weekly blogs, a word I didn't even know existed three months ago. This is a remarkably historic time. Nobody asked for it, nobody wants it, nobody deserves it, and yet here we are. We are here together. We hold fast to this community and to our program. Whether it's in our new facility, at your dining table, or a combination of both, this faculty and this program continues to transform lives. Our children are developing resilience, heart-found optimism, strength, and joy through challenge. They are discovering and practicing skills they never knew they needed to have. And by necessity, they are becoming much more active partners in their own learning. They did not ask for these opportunities, but we will help them grow because of them. It has been said that they will be our next great generation. Finally, during the search process, I was asked, why Gateway, why now? Our world has changed since I addressed that question, but my answer was not. Gateway delivers something unique and extraordinary. I have seen it as a parent of a recent graduate and as a trustee. One, our mission is clear. Our program is considered and unique. Our commitment to our students is second to none. Our size allows for very meaningful community and we are a proven entity in an uncertain time. Gateway has a great story to tell. The only way to tell it is to tell it together. There is, my friends, much to look forward to. I do look forward to this next year. I look forward to getting to know you. I look forward to getting to work, again, working closely with our faculty and administration on issues that matter deeply to us all. In short, I look forward. As we say, success starts 